Hi, it's me, Bam, and I wanted to make a video letting you guys know that on console, for console rather, the Jovian Concord update is in development. Now, sorry if you guys hear noise in the background. I don't know if you guys do or not. I decide to open my window to, you know, get a little fresh air in my apartment. So, we're going to see what happened there. But, yeah. And, who knows? I might keep it open more often. Okay. So, they've been included everything from Hotfix 24.8.2 to 25.0.8. Um, now, see, usually they do um, status threads. They don't do in development status threads a lot, which means they are very serious about this, which I'm glad they are, because this is a big update. Okay. So, um, let's see. Here's something. Fix and polish, defy the new disruption game mode, and more. Um, okay, here we go. Altogether, the size for this update will be roughly 7 gigabytes. I don't know what it will be like for all the other platforms. I can only assume it will be around the same. Actually, we might be able to check to see what it might be for another platform. Like, let's check um, Xbox One, because Xbox and Switch are also getting this. It will be 7.5 gigabytes on Xbox One, and, you know, why we're checking, we may as well check the Switch as well. I won't be doing this all the time, but this is a pretty big update, so we're going to check the Switch as well, because the Switch will be roughly 1.5 gigabytes. Okay, in case you're wondering why that seems like a drastic difference on the Switch, it's because the files are condensed a bit more for the, you know how the Switch works. The files are a bit lower, you know, stuff and condensed more so it can work. But anyway, with this update, we're getting the gas city remastered, we are also getting Hexanon. I'm not really entirely sure what all of this is used for. It might just be used for Wisp and the new weapon. Not entirely sure. We'll find out in the future, I suppose. The Amalgam, they will drop the new Amalgam mods, which should be later. Um, Let's see, game mode disruption, that's the new game mode, I actually can't wait to try to play it on my PS4 account. I tried it a little bit on my PC account, it did not go, the, I mean it went pretty well because I had someone helping me, one of my viewers um, on my stream, link in the description below. Um, helped me out quite a bit, and I got to play around with Wisp. I'll leave a link to the pre-review video I did on her. She is a fun frame. Now, um, in order to do the disruption, you will have to have completed the Thaw quest, and I believe all the way up to Oh, uh, no, this one is the one you'll have to complete the Chimera prologue. Okay, this is the new Warframe Wisp. Spoiler alert, she did very fun to use. Ooh, Tenogen bundle. We want that. Tenogen round 14 bundle. That's good, everyone loves a good Tenogen. I'll be honest, I really am feeling that Sayandana right now. Yeah. Okay. Reinforcements. The, 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 um, this is the Kavat armor she comes with. 
Um, her collection comes with a Dweller's her signature weapon, which has two fire modes. I almost forgot about the next collection. New mods and mod set. Okay. Okay. So mod sets. Basically, these are what replaced the um, dragon pack. These sets, like say you want a toxin set, fire set, um, frost set, electric set, um, one of these is slash, right? <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, there's all the sets there. Oh, we get that inventory, I mean, the UI rework, relook, reimagining. Not sure how I feel about the Syndicate UI, but everything else looks amazing. And then the new extract screen. I'll be honest, I use controller a lot on um, even on my PC account. And I thought that would be terrible, but no, it was actually very easy, barely an inconvenience to do it. And let's see. Two-toned color customization. Um, let's see, Warframe, Sentinel, and okay, okay. There you fix things out a bit. Okay, and yeah, with that said, I'm going to end this video here. This was just sort of a in development view. This was like a deep dive view. Hopefully we'll get it sooner than later. They do say on the top they're looking to submit it as early, submit it this week. That's what they're looking for. I'll update you guys when they do, actually. Um, yeah, I'll try to update you guys as soon as I get new information on this. Seven gigabytes, though. Wow, that's a biggest update we've had in a while. A while, okay. And with that said, I'll catch you guys in the future. If you found it helpful, feel free to click that subscribe button. If you liked the video, that like button. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.